golf, a passion for some, an obsession for others. But how do the world's top players feel about combining their business with pleasure? And sharing the love today, double major champion and Ryder Cup hero, Martin Keimer. I was 10 years old. My dad, he took my brother and me to a public range in Germany. And then we started and I didn't really like it at the beginning because it was too difficult. Uh, we played football. It's a lot easier. Ball, foot, boom, off you go. And then you have tees, ball markers, putting, chipping, bunker, so many different things. I didn't really like it at the beginning. But then when I was 15, 16, when I started beating my older brother in, in golf, then uh, you don't have a choice than, than falling in love with golf. Well, the great thing about that is that you're not aware of how good you are. You know, you just, you just play and you don't know much about technique. You just see the shots and you just hit it. It's just pure feel. And your, your eyes tell you how the ball lies and then you feel it's just so subconscious. And that's the beauty about being a child starting playing golf and because you create that very special individual talent that you that you create over months and years of of playing the sport i think we all have that time that where you don't particularly like golf as much as you as you did when you started but i think it's very superficial because it's just result orientated the whole passion about the sport and the feel and the core of the sport that always stays within yourself but we are all especially as a professional athlete you're so driven by results and you are judged by results and then the results if they don't come the way you want you maybe dislike it a little bit for a while but then you know exactly what you need to do in order to like it a little bit more again and then you enter the new journey